division title. between two of the best fighters in this division. Hard to find anything resembling a glaring weakness on either side when you break down. There are no weaknesses in these guys. These guys are as well-rounded as they come. They both can wrestle, both can grapple, both can strike. They can do it all. And these are the matchups that we dream of as MMA fans. Oh, nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size. Oh! Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Oh, straight right. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. And now he lands a combination. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to go. Oh, huge right hand. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. You got him. Vicious combo there. Oh, crippling knee to the body. Oh. Both of these guys going all out. High action fight here. Oh. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, Mally gets up, but he looks dazed and confused. And you hear the crowd react every time they come together because they understand the power that these guys are striking with. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, nice job to land a knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Nice punch lands over the top. They continue to exchange. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Slips the punch. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. So under 30 seconds to go in what has been a pretty entertaining and active first round. 10 seconds to go in the round. Four seconds for the end of round one. Starting to put together some oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he's going to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot that will finish the fight. Nice leg kick. Punches blocked. 
big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Well, we talked about that reach advantage as you see him land the straight punch there. Great job using his length in that situation. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Nice job landing the double jab there, DC. I mean, you are definitely crushing that one. You love that one, don't you? You love that jab. Oh, and he caught the kick. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, is that a big knee to the body? We'll see if he can follow up. Soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Well, anytime you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. All right, he's in a half guard position here, DC, and in a good spot to dole out a lot of damage out of it. A lot of damage can be done from the half guard. You sit back on that leg, you press down into your opponent, you drop elbows, you drop punches. What is very key is you controlling the underhook on the far side. If you give up that underhook, your opponent can use the half guard to build up to an elbow. Right there, his opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. This dude needs to grab. He needs to wrestle. He has to do something. He cannot take another shot like that. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. Get right here. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? Third round underway. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Nice loop and punch. How about that shin? Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Ooh, that shot was blocked. The hook lands on the counter. He doesn't know where he is. He's hurt real bad. That punch landed in the perfect spot. Big kick. Oh, nice straight there. I guess that's the quickest way to the target, right? Just throw straight. Straight down is always best. It's very good. Oh, man, look at that one body shot. Did that shows the power. And the power in the placement. It was placed perfectly, and now he's got his opponent hurt. Ooh, big shot land. A oh, really good job by him there to raise the guard, DC. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. Some real power shots here. Oh, straight right. Lighter on his feet or what it is, but these oh! Oh! Oh, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, 
punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight.